This is the famous Ivule. Uh, Ivule is the name of this river here. Uh, it is next to the Kimbe and Biela Highway. And uh, right now, as you can see, uh, it's not um, that big. It's not flowing fast. Um, it's just maintaining its uh, normal uh, course but usually when it begins to rain then the small little creek and the river on the other side uh, tends to swell up and it becomes so violent and when it becomes so violent it begins to uh, wash away the uh, the banks of the river the creeks and then the road, as you can see, is also washed away because the river floods the entire uh, section of the road. And as a consequence, uh, passengers and vehicles traveling between Kimbe and um, Biela, they all come to a standstill. And uh, until and when the river subsides, then work will continue to begin and usually it's Hagi Oil Pumps Limited that uh, uh, bring over their heavy equipment and machinery to uh, clean up and maintain the road so it is accessible to the public and so uh, uh, this little uh, section of the highway there's a long history of causing so much uh, mayhem and destruction. And right now you are seeing the top of the mountain. And the mountain range uh, is heading towards uh, East New Britain province. And that is where the Iwula River flows from. Um, right at the top of the mountain, the border between West New Britain and East New Britain province. Uh, there's a trek where people from West New Britain, they walk over to East New Britain and people from East New Britain, they walk over using the trek up in the mountains, they come uh, into West New Britain province. So, um, as you can see, uh, much of the destruction caused by the river uh, remains only just a, a few uh, sections of the road has been maintained just to allow for vehicles to travel back and forth uh, between Kimbe and uh, 
uh, Biala in the West New Britain province of Papua New Guinea. And at the back of the vehicle, you will see the remnant of the uh, bridge that was initially constructed sometime back in the uh, late 1970s, early 1980s. And due to the heavy flooding that has taken place back then, has washed away the entire bridge. And what you see now that remains is the remnant of that bridge. It is a constant reminder to the people of West New Britain province, to the commuters between uh, Kimbe and Biala, that they should not underestimate the power and the might of this Ivula River. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. This is just a brief uh, background story about this place called Ivule and the river that flows across the highway. Thank you for watching and uh, do give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. That will really uh, encourage me and motivate me to do more of such videos. Thank you and see you in the next video.